come over it. So we are doing her cartilage and a conch piercing. Just marking this one and then we're going to clean and mark the other guy. No, I had a friend here um, that got a couple piercings done, but I usually go to a different one, but they didn't have as many appointments available. Okay, well, welcome. <laughs> Thank you. Welcome for the first time here. Very cool. Hey, I'm glad people are busy, though. Like, legit. Yeah. It's been a, it's been a rough hard. year for everybody, but it's, it has definitely been a rough year for body yeah. pictures, tattoo artists, all that stuff. So, yeah. very happy everybody's getting booked out. That's good. So, what do you do for work? Um, I'm in school right now. I'm going to San Francisco State in the fall. Okay. Um, so I'm at community college right now, transferring. Now, are you you're just doing everything from home like everybody? Or are you going to campus? So I'm home? going to campus. It's like hybrid, so some of it's okay. in person. So I'm moving there in August, and we start school at the end of the month. Cool. So. Are you excited for it I'm to excited. be a little normal? Yeah. I'm going to miss online though, it's, it's so much easier, honestly. Right. Well, a lot of the teenagers I've been talking to as well, because they get out at like 12, 12, yeah, exactly. they're like, oh, yeah. like, they want to go back to their friends, but they're like way happier to have yeah, that exactly. three-hour school day. I'm going to have yeah, you so lay down on All right, just have your hands on your sides. I'm going to wash my hands, change gloves, and we're ready, okay? okay? So yeah, don't worry too much about your hair. Okay. Like that. So what are you going to school for? What's your major? Psychology. Oh, girl, everybody needs you right now. <laughs> I know, that's my life. There's going to be a demand, yeah. so leave that, for real. Yep. So what made you want to get into that type of work? Uh, I always wanted to work in some sort of healthcare. Okay. But I'm like a little squeamish with like medical stuff. Okay. So I knew I couldn't be a nurse or anything like that. And so I really enjoyed my psychology classes. So. That's cool. And mental health is like an epidemic right now, so oh, yeah. there's a lot of work to be done. Oh yeah, and we don't even have a clue yet as to how intense that's going to be. Yeah, exactly. So, Especially yeah. after the pandemic and everything. Yeah, I keep saying it's like we're not fully aware of what how it's affecting us yet because yeah. we're still dealing with it versus yeah. like having a traumatic event and then post traumatic, you know, like dealing yeah. with something yeah, afterwards. It's crazy. We're not in that PTSD moment yeah. yet. So, everyone hang in there, man. <laughs> we're all hopefully doing the best we're trying to do, so. Well, that's cool. So you're enjoying school so far? Yeah, I mean, I'm excited to be done soon, but I enjoy it. Yeah. As far as my classes. Okay, so we're doing a circular barbell in the conch. And then when does the semester end for you guys, or did it just? Um, it ended for me in like the end of May, like May 26th. Turn your head a little that way for me. And then I start on August 23rd, so. Oh, okay. I think the dates of stuff like starting and ending has changed a little bit due to everything going on. Yeah. So when do you graduate? Hopefully in like a year and a half, because I'll be going in as a junior technically, but I'm supposed to be a senior next year. It's never like a legit straight four years. I mean, if somebody's yeah. doing four years, they're like not working. Mm -hmm, exactly. They're, yeah, they're just fully killing it for college because yeah. it's, it's just hard to do that. Even when I started going to college in the late 90s, they, the like entrance like visit, they literally told us, they're like, don't think about uh, four years, think about five. And yeah. this was like way back then. Well, see, by the time you graduate, it'll be like a legit ceremony again. That's what I'm saying, that's right? what I'm hoping for. Some She's normalcy. like, yeah have a gathering of people I'm not going to do all this stuff to not have a graduation <laughs> ceremony See, that's what's trippy is like all this work. um anybody that was graduating high school i'm going to turn that one a little bit 
or graduating out of college, I was asking them, it's kind of like, if you didn't walk, did it feel like it happened? Yeah, exactly. And a lot of them were saying, like, no. It honestly did not feel like that had actually Yeah, occurred. and then it's like you don't have that closure. Yeah. From, like, that chapter of your life, and you're just moving on to the next. It's scary. So. Because that, I graduated college, and it's like that moment when you're walking, you're like, whoa. Yeah. This is, like, the real happening. Yeah. And, like, yeah, if you don't have that physical event occur, it's got to feel like something's just lingering and kind of missing. Yeah, totally so turn your face a little more that way for me. I want to be able to see the back of your ear a little bit. Okay. Well, plus it's like your family wants that moment. Mm -hmm. Everybody wants to be involved in the graduation. We all need celebrations right now. I agree, yeah. <laughs> Tough. Okay, so where this ring meets together, you want to keep that on the outside of where the skin is pierced. If it feels like it has rotated into there, then I want you to gently like wet the area and rotate it back out. All right, go ahead and sit up. You are all good. I think she's probably going to get a couple ending shots of your ears. Thank you very much. Thank you. And then all you got to do when you're done is you'll just initial the bottom of that paper right there. Okay. Right there. Just remember not to touch it. Okay. <laughs> okay. <laughs>